Hi everyone, this is Imran. Today in this video training, I'll be showing you how you can easily create a navigation menu on your WordPress website. Here goes the navigation you can see on my demo website. Here goes the about face, contact us page, home, project, sample face, and service. I'll do the same thing in this training and I'll do the job in three simple steps. Firstly, I will create a menu and secondly, I'll add pages to the menu and thirdly, I'll just display the menu on a WordPress website. So let's get to be started. Here I'm on the dashboard of my WordPress website, but this time I'm not going to install any plugin. What I'm going to do, just hover over appearance and under appearance you will see menu. WordPress comes with a very fantastic drag and drop menu builder. You can easily build any kind of menu using its interface. So what I'm going to do now, just create a menu. Okay, here you can see menu name and it starts from here. Just firstly name your menu or type the name of the menu. I'm going to type it main menu. And on the bottom and right corner, here you can see create menu button. Just click on it. And here you can see a new menu has been created. Okay. So I have very easily created or completed the first step. I have created a menu. And secondly, I'm going to add item to this menu. And here you can see add menu item from the column on the left. On the left here you can see add menu items and you will see all the pages you have created all the posts you have and you can add custom links and you can add the categories here so you will get basically four types of items page post custom links and categories and if you install any custom post type plugins and that will be appeared here okay so uh, I have already created these pages. I can show you from all pages. Here goes my available pages. If I get back and if I click on view all, here you can see all the pages. So, what to do to add these pages to this menu? Just click this checkbox and here you can see add to menu. Okay, it instantly adds here but you can select all of the menus at a time and click add to menu okay i have already added this one so what i'm going to do click add to menu and all the items have been added here so what i'm going to do i have to click save menu okay i have already created the menu i have added items or pages to the menu so what I'm going to do, I'm going to display this menu. So to display this menu, I'll have to select a location. By default, it is primary location. Okay, the display location actually depends or varies from themes to theme. At the moment, I'm using extra theme. So extra theme offers this menu location. But if you shift to another theme, then the scenario might be different. Okay, this primary menu location is selected, but you can alternatively go to here, just manage location. And from here you will see theme location and assign menu. From the drop down, you will just uh, see the list of available menus and you will select and finally hit save changes. I would like to show this menu only in the primary menu area. So what I'm going to do, save changes. So, uh, friends, visit the website. Here goes it. Okay. Now, I have created the menu. I have added pages and showed on the home page or any other page. Now, what I'm going to do, I'm going to add a custom link. Here goes all the pages. If you would like to add a link, like facebook.com you can also do that just go to custom links and here you will have to type the url 
www.imranimo.com and here you will type the level of the menu website just click add to menu and here you can see the menu if I hit save menu if I refresh this page and here you can see website that's fine and now I'm going to show you how you can create a drop-down menu. Let's see that. To create a drop-down menu, what you will have to do, just grab the page and move it to the right. I'm going to here go services and sample page. Okay, here you can see I would like to add these two menu items as a drop-down menu of services so just drag it and move it to the right hit save menu refresh this page okay here you can see if i hover over here on services you will see just the drop down menu but i'll show you how you can customize it using this customizer but I could show you how you can add a drop-down menu okay well friends let's see how we can customize the color and the color of this uh, drop-down menu to customize this you will have to access the customize option just click on customize and based on your theme you are using or activated you will see options I am using Astra so Astra comes with header builder and here you can see transparent header this is a transparent header and click on transparent header and here goes design and under design here you can see text link or text or link color and here goes sub menu color background color should be black or something like this okay say for example this and if i hit publish and if i hover over here here you can see it changes at the same time you can change the text color of this link so what you will have to do go to menu color and click on here and from here you can change any color i'm going to click red just for the sake of this tutorial and here you can see red but on hover it's here you can see white you can change the hover color to black and on hover it changes okay and if you would like to create a background color of this header what you will have to do just come over here here goes background color okay here goes background color for this section okay so if you would like to delete any item just like if you don't want to show about our space just click over here and you will see remove just click on here and hit save changes then the menu item will be deleted and if you want you can again add this item okay so well friends i hope in this video training i could show you how you can create a navigation menu in your wordpress website so thank you for watching hope to see you in the next video and don't forget to like this video and share on the social platform and leave your comments in the comment section thank you